This is James Cobb, the guy on the bike. We're going to uh, do a little Chelsea lightning round. We're going to start out with Kenny Sharp at Paul Kasman. Check it out. So this is Kenny Scharf's new paintings and Crazy Royale. And this one is Chips Galore, aka Chip Chip Hooray, aka Mother Chip. Acrylic and silk screen on linen. 108 by 144 inches. I've been looking at Kenny's work ever since his first show at Tony Shafrazi back in the early 80s when he was down on Mercer Street. This is Chocolate Donut in Space 2007. And that's eight foot square. This piece is one good thing leads to another. Six by five feet. You can see that Kenny's gotten into a lot of uh, photo silkscreen on these. And there's his disco shoes. This new work relates a lot to the pop of Andy Warhol and uh, people like Don Betchler, who's probably a good friend of Kenny's. And some of the other current pop artists that are using a lot of photo silk screen stuff. This is great to meet Shu. This is a huge piece called Tang. Well, I remember Kenny's first show, it was doing tiny little fluorescent paintings of uh, the Jetsons and the Flintstones. He and Keith Haring were running around doing a lot of tagging in the streets. And we hung out a bit at the fun gallery. And this piece is comic crude. You can see Kenny's even sold a couple of pieces here, so good for him. And that little spray paint spiral right there, that's one of his signature styles. So that's Kenny Scharf new. And we're reporting from the Sean Kelly Gallery on West 29th Street. This piece is by Wolfgang Laub and it's titled Without Place, Without Time, Without Body, 2007. Rice Mountains with hazelnut pollen. Now this is a unique installation. These sculptures are from the series Rice House. These pieces are made from black and red Indian granite, black smoke, sunflower oil, and rice. This piece is called Staircase. Black Burmese lacquer on wood. 114 by 72 and a half inches by 24 and 3 eighths inches. 
2003. Let's take a run in Mary Boone and see what she's got. This El Cassandra Mir, Mary's woman. Mary Boone. Anybody that wants to be exhibited at Mary Boone Gallery should get on down here and get to work. Cowboys or cops? Even back here in the inner sanctum. Going through a lot of sharpies here. That was Mary. Now at the Danny Wright's gallery at 537A. West 23rd Street, we're going to take a look at the Michael Klein exhibition. This piece is Still Night 2007 Oil on Linen. Now, Michael Klein's work has gotten a lot of attention because of uh, his gritty subject matter and his kind of high realism, kind of the grotesque realism. And uh, there is a kind of relationship with something like the German Neue Sachlichkeit, maybe painters like Otto Dix, when he was into his very hyper-realist phase. This is good. We've got the, the nasty skate punk. put up against the wall by the local police captain. This is called Police Line 2007. Oil on linen, 64 by 46 inches. There's also a uh, nice use of uh, tonal rendering. This is I Will Tell You Off. Oil on linen, 30 by 40 inches. Okay, we've all had one of those nights. And he's got a little note around his neck. Ask me, 9-11 was an inside job made up by the Islamo fascist CIA, King Bush, Hassam, also pussy commie liberals. I will tell you off for two dollars. Please help. God bless. Now, people from outside of New York might think these notes and these signs with kind of weird conspiracy things on them are somebody's fantasy, but. If you spend a little time walking around in New York, you realize these people are all over the place. So that's Michael Klein's exhibition, Folks, at the Daniel Rice Gallery, 537 West 23rd Street. Thanks, Kate.